Hi everybody and welcome to True Wants. Right here we try to help you decide if it's going to change from a want to a need. Now if you enjoy or you've been looking for a channel that focuses on learning about the brands, the products, and of course the deals with some spoilers and sneak peeks on subscription boxes too, then I hope you will subscribe. It is free and it is easy. Simply press the black subscribe button under the video. It will turn white and you are in. Now there is that bell right beside it. Hit that and you will have a new video notification and don't forget to hit that thumbs up which will help this video to grow. I always look forward to seeing everybody in the comments which I do respond to all but for more information and instant updates follow my Instagram where my name is true ones with the number two and the link is in the description box under the video with all my other links and if I have any discount codes as well. As you know, if I know something, I want you to know it too, so that we could be in the know together. And I appreciate you always watching in full and being part of this True Ones community. As we film live with no edits, I prepare and I do my research ahead of time. And you can always contribute to the channel, not only by watching as well as sharing in the comments, but there also is a thanks button down below. Now this is a video that's a little bit different and the reason I'm doing it is it's something that really intrigued me and I do this periodically when I have a little bit of time where I can sit down and do a little research as well as you know be able to to have it in a way that I can share with you guys without editing and be able to put a lot of pictures on the screen for you guys to be in the know as well. As you know, this month has been, it's the month of February, and we are learning a lot about the black brands. But sometimes we don't always know the face behind the brand, and we can't always connect the actual products to that brand's name, or we, we can't connect the face of the brand to the actual products of the brand. So there was something that came down through Ipsy that I found very intriguing, and I started to read it, and I was really intrigued by it, and I thought, you know what? I'm going to do my best to try to film this so that others will be able to know as the information that I know. And then I want you guys to also share in the comments because I'm always so surprised by or love learning more than surprised. I love learning about the people that are behind the brand and a little bit more about them. So hopefully this is of interest to you guys as well because this takes a lot of time to set up, let alone film it. So I'm hoping that this video will do well and then in the future we'll be able to do videos like this as well. So this is all about the black community and we have I think over 40 of these brands and the faces behind the brands. Now the black culture has brought so much within the beauty industry. They're saying from colorful square tip nails to laid edges to even euphoria styled eye makeup. The influence of the black culture within the beauty industry can be seen everywhere. From the makeup looks that when you scroll through on Instagram to the innovative products and that we actually use daily. These are black owned and founded brands with creators and artists and communities that are not only all the taskmasters behind the popular trends, but also the activists who push against outdated norms within beauty. And thanks to these inspired entrepreneurs that we are seeing shelves are finally being stocked with game-changing formulas that cater to the needs of everybody not only certain skin types as well as textures even for hair care that include shade ranges now and incredible pigment payoff because this month and every month should be an opportunity to celebrate which giving much deserved shout outs to some of the favorite black owned brands and founded beauty brands highlighted exactly what makes them so amazing. So this is something that I started doing a little bit of research on at the beginning of the month. And then of course, you know, Ipsy is such a strong company as well as BoxyCharm. I learned so much from them as well in reference to the brands. But I wanted to share with you some that we have been enjoying that maybe we did not or did not know who was behind the actual brands and some of the products behind them and the faces behind the creators of these brands, starting with Ace Beauté. How be and the pictures you will see are so breathtaking of the people. So Ace Beauté was founded by this person here, and I hope I'm pronouncing her name correctly. It's Nayi uh, Anikan Atang. And in 2016, the brand relies on the simple principle that makes 
makeup should help individuals embrace who they are. Makeup is a tool that allows people to love themselves and use it as a form of self-expression and identity. Their mission is proven to give you high quality products that appeal to a wide spectrum of individuals so that they can freely express themselves through makeup. Now, Ipsy wanted to highlight certain products within these brands. And the highlight on this one was this picture here. And this one here, they're saying, create all of your favorite fall looks with the Ace Beauté Violet Sage Palette. It features light, airy shades and deep, rich colors in both matte and shimmer finishes that blend flawlessly together. Now, I got introduced to this brand, like so many of us, through BoxyCharm before it was part of Ipsy. So I'm loving that they've taken the mantle and have really focused, you know, especially this month on this brand, but we're now starting to see this brand in a lot of other places as well. So very excited because if you're like me, I own a lot of Ace Beauté palettes because the first time I tried their shadows, I was blown away and they have never disappointed me on every single shadow palette that I have purchased or gotten a box. It has really blown my mind. So really excited about that being the number one. The second person that they're mentioning here is the brand that is called Amira Lashes. And Amira Lashes stands out as a radiant gem in the realm of beauty. They're not only enhancing your beauty of natural beauty, but also want to empower you to embrace your unique style with the confidence from luxurious lashes that frame your eyes like a masterpiece to innovate beauty products that celebrate diversity. Now, Amira Lashes is a trailblazer in redefining standards. This founder, and her name is Alisa Gordons, her vision goes beyond aesthetics. It intertwines with self-expression and inclusivity in every application. Now, the pick that they did with this were these lashes here. I'm not a lash girl, so I love when you guys share in the comments down below. This one here, they're saying they have fluttery fringe without the mess of any lash glue. This brand is focuses on magnetic lashes, making getting glam super fast and super easy. The next brand that we have here is a brand that is called Basic Beauty. Now, when I started to do this, you will see later on that she's also the face of another brand as well, and it is called Saint Lux. But starting with the Basic Beauty brand, she says it's founded with a CEO and a mumpreneur. Her name is Nicole, and she created Basic Beauty to help you feel confident with every swipe, every tap, every blend of her universally flattering shades, and she's not afraid to have fun. With names like OK Susan or it's October 3rd, each product is designed to add a touch of playfulness to your glam routine. Plus, these formulas are always paraben free, certified cruelty free, and will last all day. And her brand, the focus that Ipsy wanted to share was this product here. And this one is the Bronzy AF palette. It features three shades to create a custom faux glow any time of the year. It is highly pigmented and buildable, and this buttery soft powder formula flatters all skin tones and faces. The next one that they have is Beauty Bakery, and this is the powerful story of resilience and inspiration. Her name is Kashmir Nicole, founded the Beauty Bakery in 2011 with the mission to be sweet and sweetened the lives of others. During a challenge but successfully fight with breast cancer, Kashmir became extremely health conscious and started doing her research driven about the products we put in and on our bodies. Her brand is direct reflection of Kashmir's perseverance and passion for high quality, healthy ingredients that enhance the beauty in every one every day. The product focused on this one was this here, but I have tried so many products from this brand and the packaging is just as beautiful as the actual products inside. It says, just like the name suggested, Beauty Bakery, do it for the Graham eyeshadow palette, will help take your selfie game up a few notches. The 12 shades in flawless foils, mattes, and duochromes will light up every eye in no time. They are highly pigmented and super blendable so that you can create stunning looks in minutes and spend more time catch, captivating your gorgeous selfies. The next one is a brand that I share a lot on this channel and I got very lucky for some reason. They have started sending me PR and have put me on the PR list and I'm so, so happy about it because this is a brand that I really feel has made a difference. And I've given you the stories on my Instagram all about 
this person here and the brand I'm talking about is Beauty Stat. Now their goal is to continue developing innovative tap top performing beauty products and bringing them directly to consumers. This is the brand and the face of the founder who is a cosmetic chemist and his name is Ron Robinson and Beauty Stat launched with their Universal C Skin Refiner. And so many of us have got it in our bags and boxes in the past. It's an award-winning vitamin C serum that quickly made its way to the top of every editor's list. Now their roster has a few new heavy hitting hydrators that will definitely want to snag. And I, that's why I really hope that you follow me on Instagram because that's where I post a lot about this product when I do receive it in PR. But this is what the product looks like that I know so many of you have tried as well. And this is the one that is their part of their Universal C line. And this will be the Eye Perfector that has 5% uh, L-adsorbic acid. And that is the most stable form of vitamin C. And that's really what founded his brand was he was able to stabilize the vitamin C. This also has caffeine and green tea that will also blend and perk up any sleepy under eyes, he says. The next brand that we have here is a brand that is called Beauty Vault. And so many of us, including me, have gotten this in our boxes. This was founded in 2018 by Lola Maurice Dia. And her Beauty Vault's goal was to not only to provide an array of long-lasting transformative lippies, like lip liners, liquid lipsticks, and matte lipsticks, but also to support and empower domestic violence victims. Beauty Vault will always donate 5% of all their profits to charitable organizations supporting domestic violence victims through their One on Four program. Now, this is the product that so many of us got, and this might be one that you remember. This one here is their Lip Gloss and Liner Duo. It takes all the work out of finding your perfect lip combo. It features a brown lip liner and a chocolate scented gloss for the ultimate shiny lip. So this is one, like I said, it comes in a box, it comes as a duo, and it takes out all the guesswork. The next one that we have here is this brand that is BYOD, which stands for Be Your Own Desire Cosmetics. And this one here, it says that the is named after the CEO and founder Shanda's love of makeup and the mission to make all women feel like getting dolled up with makeup is the secret to unlocking their inner confidence. To Shanda, makeup isn't just a tool used to enhance our beauty features. It's also a tool for self-expression. And at Ipsy, we're all about that. Through the best-selling foundations, the shadows, and more, this brand will give makeup lovers the tools, literally, to define their own sense of beauty and embrace their individuality. It's what the brand, the focus that they gave for this one product they wanted to put in here was the four finely milled powders. This is a contour palette that offers buildable coverage to help create a range of flawless makeup looks. And of a lot of the products that I've had the opportunity to try, this is one brand so far that I have not based on all of the ones that we're gonna be focusing on. The next one here is Bread Beauty. This one is, it says, hailing from Melbourne. This is the founder and her name I think is pronounced Mava. And it says it's developed a love of beauty and hair care products through braiding hair in her mother's salon. While she opted to embrace her hair's natural 4C texture, she quickly discovered that not only were the brands available lacking, they, but they also for textured hair was completely left out and she wanted to have effortless carefree approach to hair routines. So she set out to change that and she created the essential line dedicated to letting all curl types apply a simplified routine, leaving more time, which is what we all should do, which is enjoy life. Now her product is here where they say this is the Kit One Wash. It's an all-in-one bundle to make washing day a breeze rather than another dreaded chore. Bonus, the included they put in a bread puff with some satin scrunchies is just as cute as it all sounds. The next one is the brand Briagio, which a lot of us have had the opportunity to enjoy. And this is the person who is behind it. Her name is Nancy 
Twine, and she is the founder, and she's no stranger to product development. At a young age, Twine watched her grandmother craft homemade hair care, which fueled her passion to leave her job in finance and create a renowned brand of her own. Today, her textured specific hair care products offer relief from the more immediate concerns like repair, volume, and curl care while maintaining her hair health for a long haul. Plus, all of their formulas are free from sulfate, silicones, parabrains, etc., as well as synthetic colors and are 90 to 100 percent naturally derived. And so many of us have had the opportunity to try this brand through Ipsy as well as BoxyCharm, and it is one that I really enjoy. And this was the one they wanted to focus on. This was her obsessed with a scalp revived charcoal and coconut oil micro exfoliating shampoo. It's the ultimate refresher to rid any excess product and build up. And I always try to use these type of products just before I'm getting a color treatment or any treatment. The next one is this brand that is called Butter Skin. And it says with a long career on camera, this person, his name is Dorian Renand. And it says he struggled to find the inclusive skincare products for melanin rich complexions until his discovery of raw organic shea butter with this nourishing ingredient and its inspiration, Butter Skin was born. Every product is clinically studied and cruelty-free, combining good-for-you ingredients and formulas that leave your skin glowing, healthy, and renewed. Then the product that would be one that they picked for us today is this one here. And this one here, it says, treat yourself to a product that started it all. It is a whipped body butter. It is made with 100% vegan or organic unrefined shea butter and it warms up on contact and melts into your skin and it says goodbye to any dry winter patches the next brand that they wanted to focus on was this one here and the name is camera aniki beauty or an anique beauty this one is an award-winning makeup artist the instructor and coach with a client list including people like uh, angela bassett it only felt natural for her to help to create a beauty brand of her own. Her mission for her brand centers around faith, so each lash is named after an iconic woman from the Bible. And here is the product here, and this one is called the Mary Lash, and is the most natural looking lash from her collection, featuring a soft, wispy look that enhances all eye shapes. The so on trend next one is this person here and her face and her smile is so prominent in my Instagram. This is Danesse Merrick's Beauty. She is coming out with so many amazing products and it really is for all skin types. This is the pro makeup artist, entrepreneur, mother, Danessa Merrix. She is the beauty industry tour de force, as well as all it takes is just one scroll through her Instagram feed to instantly be obsessed with her work. Beginning as a self-taught makeup artist, she cast industry norms aside and developed her own techniques and non-traditional applications of products. This creativity drives her cosmetic line and resulting in products that stand up to real life just as much as they would on the set. And this one here is the product that a few of us had, had the, including me, had the opportunity to play with. This one is every product we have tried has consistently changed the game, but whatever you do, do not miss the D Danessa Merix Beauty Dewy Cheek and Lip Palette. This is a multi-use lip and cheek palette that houses four lightweight creams ranging from peachy nudes to corals to medium rose and dusty mauve that will melt right into your skin and leave behind that radiant rich color. The next one is a brand that is called Eden and this is Eden's Body Works. This is a naturally cruelty free product that maintains your skin and your health with zero harsh ingredients that form formulated inclusive hair care. They proudly cater to all curl types from 2A to 4C 
And if you don't know what 2A and 4C are, whenever you go into the salon, they will look at the texture of your hair and they will be able to see actually how much curl. If it's just a wave, it would be like a 1A. Or if it sticks straight, I think it's a 1A. And then I know I'm around in the 2 series, like 2A or 2B, where there's a little bit of a wave, all the way up to 4C, which is like a really tight curl. And it says to manage her dual career in robotics. She, the brand's founder, is Jasmine. Lawrence. She is the innovator at heart. She began conquering remedies as a teenager following a damaged chemical burn which fueled her passion for finding solutions and its shine through every product that she creates today. Are these stories not so empowering? This one here they're saying their best selling is this coconut shea leave-in conditioner with nourishing and defining your curls for a textured soft and bouncy but never crunchy feel. The next one is a brand that is now one that has been on my radar for a while and I've enjoying so many of their products and it's from this brand that is called LOC uh, Beauty or how do I pronounce this properly? L Eloise Beauty probably. After working in the beauty industry for over a decade and realizing that the industry was lacking in innovative premium makeup brushes, she decided to finally start her own brand. Her name is Risi, and it says here that the goal to provide a brand of tools and cosmetics that would be inclusive for all skin tones. This brand was founded in 2017 and became a brand known for producing unique and innovative products. Now, I have fallen in love most recently with her lip oil, so we know that she is definitely getting more into products as well. And this one here is her Made with Light Reflecting Shimmery Bronze Pigments. This is her Glittered Jewels and Liquid Eyeshadow in Bronze with a leave behind a gorgeous shine and sparkle on your lids. This is a high impact color that dries to a long lasting metallic finish that we all will love to play with. The next one here is this one. And this one is a brand that is new to me. This is Estina J. And this, what is written about her, it says, this dynamic brand brings a fusion of sophistication and culture. The richness will encapsulate in each carefully crafted product from a radiant skincare essential to bold and vibrant makeup options. Estina J is more than a beauty brand. It's a celebration of individuality. This visionary founder infuses her passion for beauty with a commitment to inclusivity, ensuring that every product can cater to diverse range of skin tones as well as skin types. Now the product featured here is this one. They're saying this is the innovative 3D fiber mascara that boosts your lash volume and thickness by up to 300% in just a few swipes. The effect is so natural looking, you would swear it was magic. The next one that we have here is this brand that is called Firma. And this one here, it says the founder is Andrew Blackman. He has never been afraid to take the road less traveled from Southeast London to Canada's West Coast and enter the cosmetic industry, tool industry, with a passion for excellence. Every Firma Beauty brush is handmade in Japan. Following centuries-old traditions of brush craftsmanship alongside his business partner, Sammy, the dedication to quality at an accessible price point has given his brand a much deserved fan following. And Japan brushes are usually so expensive, but so well made. It is phenomenal to know that that is what this Firma brand is all about. This is the Silky Fluffy Synthetic Bristle of the Firma brand. It's number 204, which is a wide blend brush that made it perfect for the cream or powder shadows, picking up just the right amount of pigment and it also will help you blend with ease. The next brand's focus was this brand and it's called Flawless. And this one was crafted under the creative genius of an actress and entrepreneur. Her name is Gabrielle Union and she has a worldwide hairstylist, Larry Sims. This beauty brand exudes elegance and inclusivity. 
from cleansing and conditioning products to a wide array of curly hair styling products. Flawless is a journey towards embracing your natural beauty. The brand's commitment to diversity is not just reflective in its product range, but it's woven into its every essence. Now they have a product here that they want to focus on, and this one is called Flawless 5 Butter Mask. It soaks right into your strands using a unique butter blend of shea, uh, kapuka as well as murmuru as well as mango it, to help detangle and lock in moisture and it also gives you the most gorgeous curl ever the next brand featured is called flora and curl and this is another brand that would be new to me this was launched in 2017 by a blogger and her name is rose and she created out of her personal experience with extremely brittle dry hair as well as scalp as she experimented with botanicals and oils to create her own hair care, she quickly developed a range of natural products that would also nourish dry textured hair without overcomplicating people's routines. The main goal for Flora and Curl is to give people with textured hair essentials that are simple and easy to use. And the product focused here is this one. And it says, besides the fact that it smells like a sweet hibiscus dream, this is a curl defining gel that is favorite of ours because of its pure botanical formula that leaves your curls healthier defined and more enhanced. Plus, it's perfect for your wash and go, any twist outs, updos, ponytails, roller sets, and anything you can think of. This is her brand. The next one is one that so many of us are enjoying, and this is Keys Soul Care. And this one here is Alicia Keys. And this one exudes good vibes in her style, her music, and performances. So is beauty brand grounded in creating meaningful experiences is only natural that Keys Soul Care was developed to connect your mind, your body, and your spirit through nourishing as well as derm developed skincare. She also has these products are, that are soothing candles as well as exfoliating dry brushes. But for the 15-time Grammy Award winner and entrepreneur, it was important that her products line up also honored the rituals of beauty. It's not just the product that she uses, it's also the space she gives herself to slow down, to meditate, to do a face mask, or to do a light her favorite candle and everything about her brand is so inspirational and the scents on it are so relaxing as well. And we all know that this month they did a special kit all together that I've already shared with you on this channel. That's only $24.99. So if you haven't had the opportunity to try her products, it is available in the shopper. The next one is a newer brand and this one is called Kin Lo. And this is by Naomi Osaka. And she is a radiant addition to the world of beauty, bearing the unmistakable imprint of this tennis sensation. Her bold spirit and her unwavering authenticity, inspired by Osaka's Japanese as well as Haitian heritage, the brand's offerings transcend traditional beauty norms, celebrating diverse beauty in all of its forms. With a commitment to quality and inclusive skincare, these products cater to the spectrum of skin tones as well as textures. Now, this is the product that they're featuring on. And what I liked about this, when I went to look it up, it had three different skin tones to it. This is a mineral sunscreen and it turned on its head with the Golden Ray sunscreen with SPF 50. This is a tinted sunscreen that comes in three shades, light, medium, and deep to help cancel out any white cast typically associated with mineral SPF. Plus, it is sweat resistant, meaning you can wear it while working out and anyone feeling up for tennis, which is why she, this was such an inspirational product for her to create without worrying about losing your skin's protection. The next one we have here is this one and it is this brand that's called KNC Beauty. And it says, what do you get when you combine adorable packaging, easy to understand ingredient list, celebrity fans and effective formulas, KNC Beauty. They're saying while walking Tokyo's famed Don 
uh, Kutoto's discount mega store. The founder, Kristen Noel, she noticed tons of hydrating lip masks, realizing that nothing comparable existed in the stateside market, and it became an instant hit and grew to this for her eyes, her face, and their signature collagen-infused lip masks. And that will give us the perfect pout pick-me-up, they're saying every time. Now, this one here, they're saying they dare you not to take a selfie in these. They're saying it is the shooting star shaped eye masks and they're packed with hyaluronic acid, retinol, aloe and soothing uh, allotonins to help perk up any tired eyes. And if you've had the opportunity to try this, I would love to know because, again, this is going to be a newer brand to me. Then we have Law Beauty Essentials. And her is all about the manicure, is all about to get the first class treatment. After managing several Fortune 500 companies, Tanisha Lawrence brought her business, this to her dreams, launching a beauty brand. This is a luxurious nail polish line that gives high shine, chip resistant, vivid color for every application. And it's 13 free, which means it's free of typical polish toxins and it is totally cruelty free. And she has some really bright colors. This one here is the one they focused on. It's the bright purple shade that has a dream of sunnier spring days, as well as any dainty floral manis. The next one is a new brand that I started to see in my beauty magazines, and it's called Loved 01, and is created by John Legend. And it's a game changer, they're saying. In the realm of skincare, passionate driven by its mission to provide effective, affordable, and accessible skincare tailored specifically, again for the melon rich skin. They're saying they understand the unique needs of diverse skin tones and take a deep, bold step towards inclusivity. This is not just about skincare, it's about a movement committed to empowering individuals with melanin rich skin to embrace their natural beauty confidently. This also won some awards when I was going through my allures. And this says, this is yours, mine, ours, face and body oil. It deeply hydrates your skin with a premium blend of plant-derived oils that provide lightweight, non-greasy moisture for both your face and your body. The next one is one that we have gotten really recently where we're seeing an expansion of their line and it's called Luna Magic. Now, Luna Magic is an indie beauty and lifestyle brand founded by Afro-Latino and um, Dominican American sisters. And they want to combine their passions for beauty and lifestyle. They created a vibrant brand that celebrates their mutual love for their multicultural heritage, which is Latin culture, music, and everything in color. And then we have here one of their products. And this is their lip liner duo. And I have these and I'm enjoying them in Bonita as well as Mamacita. And these are defining your lining your lips with a pretty pout in a universal flattering pigments, helping you achieve a fuller looking lip that doesn't fade for hours. Now Bonita is a gorgeous mauve color, while the Mamacita is that beautiful mid-tone brown. The next one is a one that is growing by leaps and bounds and this one we were very lucky to get an early on relationship with this brand and this is the lys beauty there is no doubt about it tisha thompson is a total beauty powerhouse with over 15 years experience in clean beauty product development her makeup artistry her marketing finance and operation she launched lys beauty with the mission to have diversity and the beauty landscape and to prove that performance and clean formulas and inclusive shade ranges can coexist. The result is an editorial as well as consumer loved line that is entirely vegan, cruelty free, excessively priced. Every product is under $30 and free of any fragrance, talc, mineral oil, gluten and sodiums and sulfates. Now, all of us know what she has done with her brand is everything is in this triangle packaging. And more recently on her Instagram, she is going to have a blush in that tube type formula after her bronzer came also in that tube type of triangle formula that so many people on TikTok were using. So she came up with a blush like that as well. But some of us got introduced to her brand through her 
powdered bronzers and cream blushes that were in this type of packaging. And this one was the higher standard satin matte cream blush that boosts a soft buttery formula in the ultra flattering shades that effortlessly blend for all skins and it, everything you would want in her formulas are just spectacular. The next one we have here is this one here, and this is a brand that I'm new to. It is Mary Louise Cosmetics, and this is saying it is a natural skin with super fun attitude. The CEO and founder, her name is Aquila Marie Louise, and she founded inspiration through her grandmother, and we're seeing this as a good little thread through a lot of these brands a lot of them were recipes that they created with a different generation that not their parents their grandparents and it says this features effective formulas for the face and the body that are full of personality and wholesome ingredients the product here that they wanted us to see is this one and they're saying this one is named miracle serum and it is heaven in a bottle it has baoba oil as well as vitamin C that will help fade dark spots and also moisturize thirsty skin for that major glow. The next one is a brand that I have had the opportunity to try the product that is featured. And this one is from a brand that is called Mented Cosmetics. And it says proof that great ideas come from a glass of wine, a good conversation. The founders, KJ Miller, as well as Amanda E. Johnson, discuss their struggle of finding the perfect nude lipstick over a glass of Pinot. And the, and the spark from Minted Cosmetics was born. Their original shade formulations give every skin tone uh, just that right color. And this one here is this one. And this one is in pursuit for that comfortable everyday lip gloss is finally over. The Minted Cosmetic Lip Gloss is a hydrating creating their lips that are shiny smooth and have just the right amount of color. This one is the next one is one that is newer to me and this is Mystique and this one is the founder. His name is Jean-Eric Marie. He grew up in the lush tropical environment of Marutius, which created a deep connection to the natural world. After his scientific research and mentor died from a prolonged exposure to toxic products, they turned to a green non-toxic chemistry and this Mystique was formed. Every product he created is made with 100% natural renewable plant sources and zero compounds. And this, like I said, is a brand that I'm not that familiar with, but this is what his bottle looks like. And it says it's suitable for all hair types. This Mystique Hydro Serum is a non-greasy, non-sticky, and provides strands with long-lasting hydration, protection from heat and UV damage, and lightweight hold. The next one, so many of us got introduced to this brand and it's called Micho Beauty through Ipsy. And it was through their polishes. And now I'm trying some of their lip products that I'm really enjoying as well. This is an indie beauty brand that is committed to creating easy to use on-trend beauty products with a clean reputation. The founder who holds a chemistry degree and licenses in cosmetology as well as aesthetics and makeup artistry set out to create a non-toxic nail lacquer that not only would not skimp on performance, also wanted a chip resistant polish that would come in an array of super chic colors. And that is how her brand got introduced to so many of us. And this is the cutest bottle that is her creation. When you need to put the bolds on hold, this can also be a sheer rose shade that is going to be your daily go-to. The next one is a brand that I'm only more recently starting to see in our boxes, and it is this brand that is called Mo Beauty. And it says if the drag queen icon Mo Heart creates a beauty brand, you would buy it, and it is called Mo Beauty. It launched out of Mo's heart passion for the beautiful skin and the mission to make everyone feel and treat themselves like royalty. With a line of skincare cosmetics and beauty tools, Mo Beauty aims to help everybody shine bright internally as well as externally through the, his high performance products. Now, this is the product that I got introduced to his brand with, and I'm sure so many others. This is his eyebrow, pencil, and brush duo. It's all you need to take your brow game from zero to hero. Whether you like your brows natural or defined and bold, this brush will help get you there in just minutes. The next one is one that we started to see little 
glimpses of, and I didn't know enough about this brand. I'm so excited that this is part of this lineup that we could learn about. This is called the brand, and once I show you the packaging, you will see what I mean, because in a lot of uh, Ipsy's Shopper, I started to see this brand that I did not know about, and it's called Our X. Now the founder, her name is Cece, and this is a black female owned, sustainable minded, total hair and scalp wellness brand. Now she founded the brand out of her own frustration and experience with the hair care industry, lack of products for textured tresses. Do you see that, that this is every hair care brand that we are talking about today in this segment has always been that they could not find what they wanted in the industry for their type of hair. And this one says, this is the, today she and a world-class team of hair care experts developed a collection of data-informed products to help reach the ultimate hair goals. Now, this is the packaging that caught my eye, and that's when I started to do a little bit more research on this. Now, this is their gentle exfoliating shampoo that removes buildup from the scalp and your hair to reduce scalp stresses and promotes healthy hair growth. The next one is a brand that so many of us are happy we're starting to see more and more in our boxes, and it is Pat McGrath. And her brand is Pat McGrath Labs. And the myth, the legend, Dame Pat McGrath, that's right, Queen Elizabeth has bestowed this upon the mother, as she's known in the industry. Her visionary artistry and influence is one of the most revolutionary makeup artists ever fueled the creation of her own iconic brand. And magic is in everything she creates from her otherworldly palettes to the lipsticks in the sequence filled pouches. And this is a brand that I used to wait for Sephora to have these type of kits. And you can see those little gold foils on the bottom. This one, it says, go big with the mothership eyeshadow palettes, or you can start with her lipstick minis, which we get very lucky to get in the 350 section in the add-ons. And this is a nice way to introduce yourself to her brand. The next one is the brand that is called Pear Nova, which we also got introduced to through her nail polish. But this month, I'm still waiting for my Ipsy Glam bag. When it arrives, I will have her eyeshadow palette in there. So I'm excited to try a little bit more from the brand. Now, Pear Nova was created in 2012, and this is the product founder is Rachel James. Her love for art and passion for elegance. This brand draws inspiration from the world's wonders, runway designers, and remarkable women. Since its launch, Pear Nova has expanded and also is remaining true to its mission to celebrate all skin tones while creating healthy, luxurious nail products. But like I said, a few of us had the opportunity to choose her other new product that we are going to be getting in our boxes this month, in our glam bags, excuse me, this month. This is the Look Like a Jet Setter Without Leaving Your House, the Pear Nova Nail Lacquer Duo in Trip Around the Sun and Tokyo After Glow. The Trip Around the Sun is a classic banana yellow cream color and the Tokyo After Glow is a sky blue cream shade, both containing argon oil, which is known to help restore your brittle, peeling or weak nails back to the strength and replace protein loss to help prevent breakage. Plus, their lacquers are free from all of the formaldehydes and as well as the resins, everything negative from the fragrances on down to the animal ingredients. And like I said, this is how a lot of us got introduced to her brand. The next one we have here is People of Color Beauty. And this is after growing up with nail color that, tre that treated deeper skins as an afterthought. The founder, Jacqueline, founded People of Color Beauty with the mission of creating nail polish colors that were designed to complement the various shades of brown skin. Each collection created by this person treats your skin of color as their first thought, resulting in vibrant hues with names that honor trailblazing female leaders and empowering pop culture references. And let me see if I have her product here. I do. This one, it says, not only are these bright red and light taupe nail polishes chip resistant, as well as ultra glossy, they are 10 free too. That means they are made without questionable ingredients, like I've mentioned, the formaldehydes and so on. And sometimes found it in conventional nail polishes all the time are those negative toxic ingredients. The next one we have here is pink 
Lips Cosmetics. And this is another one that we have more recently had the opportunity to try this brand. This is inspired by her two-year-old daughter's love for makeup. Pinky, Pink Lips Cosmetics founder started her brand in 2011 in her mom's kitchen. As a single mom, she couldn't have always afford to buy her daughter lip gloss. So she Googled the ingredients, began making tons of lipsticks, and everyone loved what she made. A few months later, after spending or sending out a tweet, she received funding from an angel investor who believed in the brand, and that's when it all took off. Her products are now sold at Target stores, as well as Target.com and, of course, her own website. And this is one that we've had the opportunity to try in our bags and boxes. This is the longevity has never looked so luscious. This Pink Lips Cosmetics Liquid Lipstick in Love Her stays on without smudging or smearing for up to 13 hours and gives your lips that perfect plum berry color. Best of all, it is a non-drawing and feels comfy too. We're getting near the end of this, but there's so many more people that I want to mention. Now, this is St. Lux, and this is the one that we talked about earlier that she says this is the inspired founder who owns not one, but two epic brands. As the former hairstylist and makeup artist turned entrepreneur, Nicole also founded Basic Beauty that wanted to create a line that could perform a real life without compromising ingredients. This cruelty-free luxury products are designed that make you feel like you have a pro treatment from the comfort of your home. Now with St. Lux, the product they wanted to feature was the soft glow that can be built up or buffed out. This is the new liquid glow champagne highlight. It is incredibly flattering and super versatile. It's a must have for any makeup kit. The next one is a newer brand to me and this one is called Scone Cosmetics. And this, the brand is Natasha Caesar and she is Trinidad and she is born entrepreneur founded this brand in 2009 and after she decided to swap the corporate world for the following her dreams opening her own cosmetic line what makes scone cosmetics an ipsy fave is that the brand's purpose to create products that people love that make them love themselves for who they are through the hero products like her tattoo liner and brow wand she offers them so that you would be able to slay all day now, like I mentioned, this is not one that I've had the opportunity to try yet. So if you have, please share. We can't get enough of this liquid liner for its insanely precise tip and long lasting in a waterproof formula. Now, this is a brand that I'm very excited about, and it is called Topicals. This is the only way you haven't heard of Topicals by now is if you are living under a rock. It says the FYP popular brand was founded by this entrepreneur, and her name, I'm trying my best to pronounce the names correctly as well as the brands, and I apologize if I'm not. This is Olamide, uh, her name, and it says, out of the goal to normalize all the skin types and conditions as she grew up with a chronic skin condition herself and struggling to find products that she loved. The brand's motto is you make your skin look good, not the other way around. Topicals prioritizes making the products that make treatment skin conditions more approachable and fun, hence the stellar marketing and super always cute packaging. Now this, when I show you the packaging, you will see, and this is a brand that I got introduced to actually in another uh, subscription box that I get on this channel as well. And I'm loving that it's one that we're learning and seeing in a lot of other boxes. We are in love with this moisturizer because it helps treat the appearance of KP by exfoliating dead skin and clearing any clogged pores. And they're saying it will cause, they're giving a warning that it will cause your softest skin ever. The next one here has been through a little bit of a transformation, and that is this brand that is called Uma Beauty. But what Ipsy has written about the founder, who is a Nigerian-born former beauty executive, her name is Sharon Shooter. This is the Uma Beauty range is rebellious, innovative, and creative for all. They existed to rewrite the rules of inclusivity and diversity to create a world of beauty that truly is all of us. Now, Shooter's Innovative called on brands, including Ipsy, a hashtag that said, pull up 
or shut uh, yeah pull up or shut up it says to back up their words with meaningful action leading a long overdue movement to increase black representation in the workforce now she also had a brand that she also created that was uh called the sharon shooter it was also from the uma brand but it was available at walmart she also went on a personal journey that she was feeling exhausted because she put so much of her time and energy into this brand that she took a step back. And I think that was over a year ago. And we're starting to see that this brand is not doing as well as it used to do under her passion for this brand. So the this is a brand that everything that I have tried, I've really enjoyed, but I did get introduced to it through the love of shine of gloss and the color payoff of her traditional lipstick. This Uma Black Magic Hypnotic Impact High Shine Lipstick is about to be your new obsession and it gives your lips that reflective glow as well as bathe them in long lasting rosy pigments as well. And then the final brand that they wanted to feature was this one that is called V Cosmetic. Now, Vicky is the founder of V Cosmetics in 2017 out of the inspiration of her own line. And let me see if I have, I, I thought I had her picture. There we go. And this one says, it says, make your inner beauty stand out through products for all the shades and authenticities with a wide range of variety of shades. This aims to represent an inclusive and authentic image of beauty. Now, a lot of us had the opportunity to learn about her brand and we did it through her lip product. And that is this one here. And this one is the liquid lipstick that boasts a highly pigmented color payoff that dries to a full coverage matte but it leaves a rosy pink shade behind. Now, this is so fantastic that Ipsy has given a commitment in showcasing these black owned and inclusive brands, and we can get them in the glam bag, as well as our BoxyCharm box, as well as in our, uh, sh in the shopper, as well as the feature this month that they did a fantastic bundle by Keys. So I found this to be very interesting. And this, like I said, I do not edit here. I have been talking now for close to an hour, doing hours and hours of research to be able to have this and to share with you guys and to also have this within my videos that if I want to go back to learn a little bit more about a brand that maybe we did not know about or did not see the face behind it or the inspiration behind it is why I like to share so much on my channel when we go through each and every product is what it is all about because it's more than just is you know if you like it or you don't like it if anybody has ever created a product or thought of starting a business there is so much that goes behind way before we get it into our bags and boxes so i want to give kudos to ipsy that has taken the time to do a lot of the research finding the women-owned brands finding the cruelty-free brands learning and sharing all of the love of the beauty industry with us in a way that is for affordable to so many of us to be able to try so many brands. So when they get focused and featured through an Ipsy bag or a BoxyCharm box, it is so inspiring to take the time as a person who chooses to have a channel to not only focus on how it swatches or how it feels from the packaging to the actual formulation of the products, but to also learn a little bit more about the brand. And that's why on my channel, I choose to do informative videos. I choose to film, which I did for the first three and a half years of having this channel, where my face was in front of the camera and I was showing you, and if I'm trying on products and I wanna share with you my makeup of the day, I thought it was essential for you get to know me by my face. But I am somebody who is an entrepreneur that had a business for over 25 years. And when I moved to the States and social media was something I knew nothing about, I wanted to learn about it. And then I felt as I was learning, I thought it would be a great idea to also share with others that maybe were learning too. And that is why I started the channel, but I always wanted it to be a more informative channel because I felt when I was watching, as much as it was fun to see what everybody else got, I wanted to know more. And that might just be because I'm an entrepreneur myself and there's always a backstory of, of, of the person that is behind the brand. And that is why when I started to read about this, I wanted to sit down and share. So if you've watched it all the way to the end, I appreciate it so much. And even if you're just listening in the background and taking a glimpse here and there, 
I appreciate so much that even when you're watching on TV, you'll still take the time to come to the channel to leave a comment that you've watched the video in full. So I appreciate that so much. And the way we do that is we leave a little nugget at the end of the video, which will always start with TW, which stands for true wants, because like I've mentioned all the time, I have way more wants than needs. But when we have the opportunity to try all these type of products at a fraction and an affordable price, that is why I love getting subscription boxes. And that is always where my focus has been on sharing about the brands, the products, and of course the deals. And when we can get the best deals through subscription boxes, or through the shopper, or like I said, with every box that I choose to still purchase for this channel, even if I get PR from that brand or that box, I still choose to purchase it because I want to also know and remind myself of why I started this channel. It was to learn more and open my eyes to more and be able to share the deals that are out there for you to be able to enjoy the luxury. And it truly is a luxury to learn about beauty and fashion and more. So thank you to everybody that has watched this all the way to the end. And the code is going to be TW. Um, long videos informative videos let's just say informative videos all right so thank you to everybody i hope everyone continues to stay safe and well so that we can still have the time to enjoy together here and as always i love when you guys take any time out of your day to spend it with me here it means everything that i have found a community of others that enjoy this type of content as much as i love creating it for you and that's it for now. So take care, everybody. Continue to stay safe and well, and I'll see you all soon again in the next video. Bye for now.